Hello and welcome back to Piston Heads. This is a show where we find cheap cars for you for challenges such as off-road capabilities, drag racing and many many more. Tonight's challenge though is a little bit different. Me and Kyle are going to be finding out which is the best van to use in GTA Online. So vans have to withstand a lot of punishment and have to be quite fast so tonight we're going to be taking two vans through their paces to find out which is the best van in GTA Online. Well we're uh, we're here with our vans as you can as you can see um, we've we've both gone for very different builds here haven't we? Yeah definitely. Um, so this is Kyle's Weasel News van that I am pretty sure he he robbed from Weasel News. Did you did you mug the guy for this and just no, upgrade I've got, it? I've got a part time job now. Uh, um, I work for the company and uh, I just thought I'd use the uh, the van to get an exclusive. Oh, fair enough. See, uh, see, the reason I'm doing this video is for the company. Ah, uh, it's uh, a bit of promotional um, video yeah, for yeah. Weasel News. So, uh, what upgrades did you put on this? So, <laughs> so as uh, as you know, it's been it's been a day or two since we originally started recording. So, I'm questioning why I did this first one, but I did a level one armor upgrade. No idea why. Okay. But then, <laughs> but then I've got um, maxed out engine, so I've got full engine upgrades on this, and I also have level one uh, suspension lowered on it and uh, okay. that's pretty much all I could get on it. And you've kept the stock wheels I can see. Yeah, I, I, there's, I think I only had like 2,000 left and there's not a lot of uh, things that go for that. So. Well, uh, I think it looks pretty cool. Um, I like it. Um, and then we move over to my van. I've gone for a very different build. I've brought the Yuga van over here. Um, <clears throat> Going through the upgrades, obviously I purchased the van in black and I painted this this nice blue colour. This is a surf blue. I think it looks really nice. Uh, then you can obviously see I've gone for the carbon fibre hood option there. A little bit of weight reduction, which is going to make it nice and speedy. Um, I've also gone for a van conversion, so you can see on the side... There used to be windows in the side of the van, but I've changed that so it's now a, um, so it's now a van. So there's no windows in the side. Um, I've gone for a level three suspension drop, so this thing is a lot lower than it would usually be. But as I was driving here, um, it did almost topple over. Like I got it on two wheels, so it's still quite top end. It's like still quite top heavy. Um, on the back, I've gone for a race exhaust pipe. Uh, <laughs> it looks ridiculous on a van, wait, but wait, wait, uh, I got to see this race exhaust pipe. Yeah, it's like titanium tip exhaust. It looks really cool. <laughs> I thought it looked cool, and it spits flames, which <laughs> is even better. Don't even know where the exhaust. So uh, yeah, and then to complement the race exhaust, I've gone for a level three race engine conversion so i've not gone for transmission upgrades we saw last week that you don't want to go for transmission you want to go for engine upgrades so i've tossed on the level three engine and that was all of my budget i had a grand left over after all of that so i'm pretty happy with my van it, it's very it's I'm very happy. much uh yeah i i like what i've done with my van i've just uh i'm just seeing now the difference in suspension between yours and mine is, uh, you gonna... can drop it even more. This is only level three. You can drop it to level four, and it is still quite significant. It basically slams it, but I couldn't afford that. I would have yeah. gone for that, but then I wouldn't have been able to get an engine upgrade. So uh, we had 15 grand to upgrade our vans. So uh, that was 15 grand to purchase and upgrade the vans. So um, we didn't have a whole lot of budget there, but you know what? I'm pretty happy with it. <clears throat> but 
but we are both lined up here as you can see at the airport for our first challenge today if you're a man with a van one thing you're going to need to do is get away very quickly in a chase situation and part of that is going to be straight line speed so we're going to have a short drag race up the airport runway here to determine which of our cars or well, which of our vans sorry is the fastest so uh kyle do you want to do the honors yeah i will do let me just open up my window here Oh yeah, oh, spitting them flames out the back. Look at this. So everyone knows how this goes. The moment the grenade explodes, we sell. And yeah, well I guess we'll see who gets to the end. My race exhaust is ready to go. It's gonna give me all of the boost. There we go. Oh, Kyle has got a much better launch than me. Look at him go! He's off the line like a bloody... I don't know. I need to get this report in quick. If I don't get it in, I'm fired. <laughs> he is rabbiting away. Look at this. He's gone. I'm going to go for a little bit of first person right here. Well, I think we found the clear winner here. Kyle has absolutely blown away in that van. How did you do that? Um, I'm a news reporter. I ignore, I, I ignore all the traffic lights. Well, uh, uh, that's one point to you then, Kyle. Uh, yes. You, what what level engine did you that's, go for? That's max. Okay, so, I, so you've gone for a level four yeah, yeah, engine level then. Four. I only could afford a level three, so that's probably partly to do with it. I, was, I, I was thought your ammo would slow you down. And I've got carbon fiber hood. I was just um, very surprised at how fast, like how much of a difference there was between the cell. Like I would have thought it would have been a quite slow cell for both of us, but I actually. I you you had a there. very good launch there. You didn't really pull that much at the end. Initially you did, but at the end you were uh, pretty. Yeah. Pretty good. Pretty good. Anyway, we're going to move on to our second challenge now, uh, which is going to be another speed test, but this is going to test our suspension and the handling of our vans. So, uh, yeah, we'll see you over at the Piston Heads test track. Okay, so we're back here at the Piston Heads test track. Kyle is over here giving me the bird. Um, and he's also lined up for his uh, his test run. I've got my stopwatch ready. Are you ready, Kyle? I am ready, Troy. I've only got one grenade left, so uh, <laughs> let's make this one count. Don't drop it like you did last time. Here we go. Grenade okay, has okay. been thrown. And the timer has started. Kyle is away. That, that was quite a fast uh, takeoff, to be fair. <laughs> Obviously, it's not going to be as fast as uh, anything else you'll see in GTA, is it, though, Troy? Not really. Uh, I think any other vehicle in GTA will be faster than our vans, but, see, you know. The, them two turns right there, they're, they're, like, very... They give you a massive, like, vibe as if you're going to spin out, if you get what I mean. Uh, and especially with this one, because this one right here, this little UE that you do... It's more of a it's more of a drift thing. Every time I see that, I think I need to drift around that. But obviously, <laughs> in the in these vans, you can't drift, so it's just all about braking and trying to get precise with them. So on this left turn here, I like how you've blocked all this off though, because you made this track, didn't you? I did make this track, yeah. Yeah, it's very very well made, and it. I like how you've not kept it all narrow, you've kept it wide so even if you do want to race with others and not just use it as one lap as uh, we do here, see it this left turn as well, it's very wide and open so you can actually do what you want and... Hey! Hey you! <laughs> That's not nice! No. <laughs> Take this right turn <laughs> to avoid him. This is something you've got to deal with when you drive the van. <laughs> when you're a reporter! <laughs> I work at Weasel News, just people shooting. <laughs> Here he comes to the final corner, ladies and gentlemen. 
It's going to be... Oh, he's on two wheels there. <laughs> and across the line. That, that was a blistering lap time, actually. That was pretty damn fast. Oh, I'm hoping, I'm hoping. Ooh, that's that's not a <laughs> that's not a stopwatch. That's a that's a packet of whatever. Um, I've not got any more grenades left as well, so if we do any good. more of these, I'm gonna have to buy some more. <laughs> buy some grenades. <laughs> buy some grenades can so I, we can start. Uh, can you imagine like walk, walk <coughs> up to the sh like walk, walking up to the guy at the counter? It's like, oh yeah, what do you need these grenades for? Oh yeah, I'm doing a lap of the track. <laughs> <laughs> So, no, we, we don't we don't do three two one go. We do. Imagine go. explaining the health and safety of that. Um, <laughs> we're not so sure about the use of grenades to start your races. Yeah, but and, and then the guys like and the guys like, but no one's ever been hurt with one, right? It's like, oh yeah, well one person did drop one and blow up the participant. <laughs> <laughs> but ah no, it's it's the ninety nine percent chance it's gonna be fine. So Troy, are you ready for your lap? Um, I guess I'll have to be ready because I'm lined up. So, yeah. All right. Well, as uh, soon after as the, the drag goes... race, after the drag race, I don't feel as confident with my van. But you know. <laughs> well, maybe it's all to do with the driver. Never know. Could be. Right, could so the be. It's been chucked here. Get ready. Get that race exhaust popping. There we go. That was the slowest getaway in that, the history was, of anything. Slow. And it, <laughs> the speed isn't there. Uh, this is going to be the slowest slap time of our track ever. I know what it is. I get a lot of wheel spin off a line and it just doesn't get going. I also have no brakes, as I've just discovered, coming out of the chicane there. I have no power. I have no brakes. Oh, that's not nice. And it's very top heavy. It leans. It's leaning so much. Oh no. It is leaning. Did I just hear a gunshot then? No, but you'll probably hear the master. Oh! Like that, that was the <laughs> widest part coming into the fly through. Quite nice through there, but that's because I wasn't going very quickly, so... Oh, oh, we've got some gunshots going on the back here. Coming on really to... Really don't hit your tyre. Oh, a little bit too much on the grass there. Oh, Coming oh, into oh, oh, the oh, oh. final hairpin turn there, onto the short straight. I feel like I was just going to absolutely... blow my brains out coming onto this last section. I can feel you aiming at my head. <laughs> I saw the bullet go behind me then. Coming on to the final corner though. Keeping in nice and tight there. A bit wide on the exit, but that is going to be across the line. And there we have it, everyone. Aldi Worm entered first place. Um, so you have my lap time. I have your lap time. Um, yep. Shall we compare notes? Yeah, can do. Do you want yours first, or do you want to give me um, mine first? Like, yeah, I'll, I'll give me mine first, and then I'll give you yours if you want. Okay, so what what do you think you got first? Let me ask you that. Based on what you got, I reckon mine was slower. So I'm gonna guess mine was about one forty-five. Oh, that's a. Uh... It's close, close to be fair. You got one minute, 37 seconds, and 0 0.6 milliseconds. <gasps> you have no idea how close this is. Are you ready for yours? I am ready for mine, yeah. So what did you say mine was again? 137.06. Your lap time, you could be really pissed off about this. Was a one thirty seven point zero nine. Oh no, <laughs> you were that no, you were literally that close. <laughs> three milliseconds. There was too three slow. milliseconds in it. There was three milliseconds in it. So when it comes down oh. to technical driving, technically. 
I think I'm better because you had more power than me, as we saw from the uh, yeah, drag, yeah, 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 yeah. drag strip. So, yeah. Okay, I'm feeling a little bit more uh, confident about my van now. But anyway, um, part of being a van man doesn't just come down to how much speed you have. You've got to deal with other things like having a police cruiser ramming you up the arse. So for our next challenge, we're going to head over to the Boiling Broke prison and see if we can bust out some of the inmates. I'm literally me entering first area, person. Me, me, me entering Area 51. Me <laughs> Thank area God. 51. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> A weapon upgrade, boy. <laughs> okay, so uh, we're over here now at Bolingbroke Prison. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, Bolingbroke. Bolingbroke <laughs> Penitentiary. That, that's where we're at. See, see, I've got my Google Translator over here. Uh, we've got both of the vans, and as you can see in the background, I have brought my Helma chapter because nope. I'm going to be recording this from the sky. Basically, how this is going to go down, um, one of us is going to either drive in or reverse in, however they choose, into the prison. As you can see, the gate opens, and then... The gate up there will also open. And when you get into the second gate, you will instantly gain four stars wanted rating. And it will be a test of who can get away from the cops in the shortest amount of time. So I'll be timing this. I will be flying in the helicopter and filming it from the sky whilst Kyle is getting away and then... On my run, Kyle will go in the helicopter and video it for me. So you'll get a view from the ground and also a view from the air. And I will be timing it for Kyle's run. Kyle will be timing it for my run. And basically, whoever has the shortest um, run will win the challenge. So it's currently 1-1. One, one, so this will be the deciding round. Uh, we've both got radars off as well. Um for this challenge so we won't be able to see where the cops are but we've got the hood turned on so we'll be able to tell when we've lost our wanted rating so um are you ready to go kyle i'm a certain with your minigun i'm actually yeah. going to turn my radar on for just for now reasons, so i can yeah. keep a track of you okay he's going into the prison which way are you going to go in? I'm going to reverse oh, he's, in. He's, he's going to reverse into the prison. I'm not going to get too close because I'm going to get wanted. If do this. Right, so the, just the challenge begin the moment I get cops? Uh, yeah, so if you tell me as soon as you get cops... Right, are you ready? Yep. Now. Okay, the timer has started. He's got four stars wanted. You can see the prison guard is running out there. He's off. He's crashing through that barrier. I can see a cop car coming down the road. What van? It is a SWAT van. Oh, he's gone for a bit of a jump there. He's got two helicopters on him as well. Where's he gone? He's over here. Have you got any <laughs> tactics with this, Kale? Oh, he's Don't rolled die. his van. <laughs> Don't die. If you die, then... Um, I don't know. Oh, <laughs> that wasn't me. I no, swear no, to no, it, no. It the helicopter. I know, I know. Oh, he's rolled again. I'm trying not to crash into this police helicopter. It's quite difficult. Well, you know what else is quite difficult? <laughs> Escaping a helicopter. Yeah, that is, uh, I imagine, quite <laughs> difficult. We oh, both couldn't afford bulletproof tires with the budget we had so if your tires get shot out your tires get yeah, shot out left. basically his front ones have gone okay the front left front left still got front right so when your front ones go you have no steer and your back ones go you have no traction which, which do you think is better i'd say front ones probably A steering's definitely better yep. 
I think having your front tires so you can actually oh, oh. so you can steer. I'll just go this way. <laughs> These helicopters are having quite a difficult time. They've crashed into each other multiple times. Yeah, I will say this looks really cool here. Except crashed. from when you crash, yeah. But when you're not crashing, it is pretty cool. Time to get Police some helicopter speed. has almost crashed into me again. He's going back towards the prison. I'll return the footage, don't worry. <laughs> We are both not allowed to return fire in this challenge either, so it will be purely a test of driver skill to get away from the cops. I assume you still got cops, yeah? Yeah, definitely. <laughs> Unless those <laughs> helicopters are after you. Uh, <laughs> Unless they're after me, yeah. Uh, he's gone onto the freeway, he's crossed the freeway, and now he's onto the train tracks. Where is he going? I'm not actually too sure where I'm going myself, to be honest. I'm just trying to get rid of these helicopters, and I'm thinking the only. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm thinking. I'm thinking of this spot, and I'm, it's going to take me a while to get there. I think, but. Well, I will say none of the police cars seem to be following you onto the tracks. Um, they're all sticking to the motorway, so you're quite in the clear with that. You've also just sort of lost the chopper because it crashed into a mountain. I've so you've got, got one chopper head. right above you, um, but you, you're a bit in the clear here. You're doing pretty good actually. You are already at the three and a half minute mark though. Oops, yeah. I am also now wanted. Oh, that That's it. Oh, he's going into the tunnel. Is he going to park in the tunnel? I don't think it'll work. The choppers are looking for you. Oh, the it's police working. are going around the... It's working so far. Beth the police Beth are going the around. Beth the X to, uh, to duck down in this car that's <laughs> got no window. Have we got anymore. any... We've got no vehicles entering the tunnel from either side. There are some police vehicles over here. They oh, are getting out of their vehicles. There's a policeman on foot, so he may come into the tunnel. He's running towards the tunnel entrance. He is now on the tracks. Ah, we've been found again. Yeah, there's a man literally at the entrance of the tunnel. Weasel News is on the move again. Nope, it, no, he's crashed it, again. This, this is what you get for looking into Area 51, guys. This is why we need to storm <laughs> it on September 20th. Be there or be, be, there or be square. <laughs> be there if you can afford the plane ticket to America. Uh, yeah. I don't need to, I don't need to save up to buy a buy a car. I'll just By the buy time this ticket. video comes out, uh, the storming may have already happened. So if it has, uh, it's, then it's tell us September. how it went. Oh. Your video's not going to be that layout. Is it? Fully not. Oh, we're going to repeat. We're going to repeat the uh, the rebel challenge, <laughs> the off road challenge. <laughs> Uh, He's going, is it faster than when you went in the Rebel? No, definitely not, I'll say that. <laughs> I mean, you are in a van. Oh, that punted him onto the tracks there. You are at the six mark minute now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You've still got two choppers on you. Um, I think, shall we say, when we get to the 10 minute mark? We're, we're, yeah, yeah, we'll end it if it gets to it's, 10 um, I think you're going for the other tunnel, aren't you? don't know what you mean. There's a tunnel this way? Yeah. I only know because I got a delivery vehicle stuck here once on a resupply <laughs> mission <laughs> in this tunnel. And then the train came and exploded me. There isn't a tunnel here, I don't know what you mean. 
Well, no cars are following you. You've got two choppers on you. The chopper has just crashed into the mountainside. Well done. Well done, LSPD. Obey and survive. Can we see Kyle in here? Can I put my light on? Can we see him in here? I'm going to trick you into thinking that a train is coming. With my single headlight helicopter. <laughs> Can you see me? I can't see you in there. <laughs> oh, he's out of his vehicle. I would laugh so much if a train came. Oh, yeah, man. I'm so... Right, I'm losing the cups <laughs> and I think I'm about to lose them. So when I say... <laughs> When I say yes, that's You've got I, two uh, helicopters out here, and multiple cars. Get ready to stop There's that no timer. Train. I'm ready. And got the eight minute mark. Oh no. There though, go, 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 go. There you go. Gone. Um, that, that was quite a lengthy getaway, but I, I like the tactic. That, that was a good tactic there. Wait. <laughs> Cut. <laughs> there's a there's a there's a policeman just walked behind my van. I think he's just checking it out to see if uh, if I've got any drugs in the back. Oh, it's only cat, mate. A little bit of cat never hurt anyone. Only bit of cat. Yeah. So, Troy, are you ready to start at the challenge? I am ready. Yeah, I'll I'll get lined up, ready to uh, reverse into my into my. Yep, uh, yep, yep. I'll just get my timer ready. Hold on, I need to uh, open my back doors so the hostages can get in a bit easier. Oh. The hostages? The, the, <laughs> the prison people, is what I meant. Alright, I'm going. There's no one in this guard thingy this time. There we go. Go, 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 go. Right, I'm going to duck this time. I've got fast... Daz, this guy's not even bothering. No, he's not bothered. Oh, he's just pulled out his gun. I need to no, close my doors. <laughs> They're gonna ah, fall out. My door's still open. The hostages, <laughs> I mean the prisoners will fall out. I'm being shot quite a lot. Here's there is two, two, two helicopters after you. Yep, two helicopters after you. And they do not look friendly, I'll oh. tell you that. Oh, you've got multiple swap cars coming in. And oh, oh they, they've these, taken a tire out. These helicopters are on. A cop car coming from the front now as he tries to swerve away. Oh! I think I've lost both my front tires. <laughs> it's not going as good I've as just, it should have, this attempt. I've it? just been headed by a bloody police car. So, no uh, tires. Where am I going to go for this? No front tires. It's probably not the best. But, uh, I like Kyle's tactic of the tunnel. Oh no, it's a back tire they got. Oh, that's not bad, that's not bad. Means I'm going to be drifting quite a lot though. Alright, come on. Oh, the SWAT vans just punted the police car away. colliding each other. They can't decide who wants to get the promotion. Alright, we're going off road. I'm spinning out. I've done it. Oh, oh, I've got a police van. Oh, no. hey, don't die, don't die. Keep going, keep going, keep going. I've got a policeman right up my anus. That's not very that good. That sounds, sounds a bit sexual, really, but... This guy's blocking that. No, don't block me. I'm going back to the prison. <laughs> I'm literally doing the same as you. <laughs> Loop back. Now I'm going to go for a different track. I've lost a bit of power because my back tire has been shot, but we're fine. Oh no! Come on, come on. Go, 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 go! Oh, they've shot a tire out. Another one. Which tire has gone now? Uh, both my left side tires have gone. My front left and my back left have gone. So I've got not much steering the now. Ooh! Oh, he's about to go off road. Can he get the steering? Back? Yes, he can. This police helicopter is about to crash into me. I don't well. see you anymore. Oh, you're there. Man, they've got these roadblocks set up. 
No! Oh, we shot another tire. I'm oh, keeping it on the road. Is that three Provide tires going all together? That's three tires now. Oh, that police van nearly hit my back. My front right tire has gone now, so I've only got so one rear would, tire remaining. We, you would have thought we'd lowered suspension that uh, they wouldn't be able to shoot as much as the tire, but... Well, that is not the case. <laughs> I think it's making it easier, honestly. They seem to be getting these tires pretty easy. I have no turning. I had no turning it. Because my van understeers a lot. Now, it's just I don't turn. <laughs> Police car, I'd appreciate if you didn't do that. Oh, there are a lot of police cars in the road. Alright, we're going off road. Probably not a great idea with only one rear tyre, but you know, we gotta take them chances. These helicopters are getting really low towards with the swap vehicles. I'm hoping these trees will give them some grief. At what time are oh, we yeah, at? Well. Uh, we're at four minutes coming up now. All right, all right, not bad, not bad. I've got, I've got a tactic in mind with this. If I can just make it there before <laughs> drives into his garage. <laughs> not quite that. That would be cheating. <laughs> Los Santos <laughs> customs. <laughs> I literally had to use the wall to turn me. Then the yeah, van. I've good. got no turning. I've just oh, gone straight into the van. Straight into a swap van. And see how this is going to unfold. Come on, come on, get the power down, man. <laughs> yes, give me a give me a ram up the bum. No police car, don't do this to me. Welcome back yes, to our context. Fine. There's a there's another uh, roadblock. We'll just ram through that. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. All right, I've I've gained a bin down. Wonder of opportunity. These two helicopters are still on your turn. Come on, I've got no turning. I'm on full lock turning now. Here we go. Has gone to the city. Has taken. Oh, he's flipped it. Oh yeah. Um. No. Come on. Don't drown the van now. <laughs> Do not drown the van. So that's what time we at? We're at uh, five minutes twenty. All right. Yeah, we're, we're doing good here. So as we saw on Myron, I went into the further into the desert towards Plato Bay. Not Plato Cheeky Bay. handbrake. Something. Nope. Something Didn't work. Oh, he's wanting to go into the three uh, point turn. <laughs> I mean, I think it's probably the only way I'm going to get away with, away from them at this point. Right, come on, come on, come on, come on. There's a tram. It's not on my lane now. Oh, I've rolled my van. Okay, I've lost the stars. Um, well, I've not lost them. Um, they're flashing. They're, they're flashing now. We should be good. I'm actually just going to park up. I'm that confident. My van has basically become a train. Because <laughs> I've got no tyres. When I wheel spin, there's just sparks everywhere. <laughs> we've we've lost a bit of helicopter coverage here, but uh, we're fine. Come on! How long does it take for them to go away? Oh no! I better not go back out here because the helicopter might see me. Come on! Come on! There we go. The cops have been evaded. What was my time? There we have it. So with me doing an, uh, what was mine, eight minutes? Um, yours was, I haven't actually given yours, yours was an eight minute, nine seconds, point three one. That's not too bad. But unfortunately, it couldn't quite keep up with Troy's time at six minutes, 48 Ooh. seconds, and 75 minutes. Just as I come out then, your helicopter crash right in front of me. But uh, it is 1-1. One, one. Uh, I mean, it is 2-1 to me. <laughs> if you want a cheap van for under 15 grand, also with some pretty decent customization, and you can also fit a fire-breathing race exhaust on your van, 
then you must pick up the Yuga, which is and the van I'm driving now, in case you've never heard of it. Um, and if you'd like to be a news reporter, grab my van. Yeah, if you want to be a news reporter in GTA, get a Yuga and put the um, news company on the side of your van. Don't buy a what? What was your van again? Um, a burrito. <laughs> <laughs> so. It was a van. With that being said, though, back to the studio. So everyone, we're back in the studio. And Kids. obviously, you... <laughs> Sorry, I just had to get that in there. <laughs> go on, go on. We'll see what Troy actually likes. As we saw in the last episode, he uh, likes under 16s. <laughs> anyway, start again, start again, start again. <laughs> <laughs> just coming for the gag roll. <laughs> so guys, we're back in the studio here with that crappy assistant over there that does nothing. My character then, actually just looked across yeah, at her yeah, when yeah, you yeah, said I, that. I just straight, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're back here with Troy, and as we saw off of today's results, the Hugo obviously beat the Brio. But the most important thing to, to bring out of this episode is that I was three milliseconds slow. <laughs> And also, <laughs> vans suck. If you want to get a car yeah. in GTA, <laughs> get a Ruiner, because that one last week, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, but for most most cars, right, honestly, for most people in this game, you can get the Elegy for free. The Elegy's just faster than a van. Get the Elegy. So what we've learned yeah. from today's episode <laughs> is, a Yuga is a good van, but it's crap because you can get it's, an elegy a, for free. It's a crap vehicle, but in the vans category, it's probably one of the best. But that's excluding vans that already have pre-modifications, so like the Rumpo Custom and stuff like that. That's that's discarded. But I will say great. I want to defend the Yuga in another way. It does have a lot of good customization. You can slam it. You can put like custom chins with oil coolers on, you can put the race exhaust on, you can put a roll cage in it, you can make it look pretty cool. So, yeah, if you want a like, van for customization, take the Yuga. It's a good van for customization, but it's not very fast. <laughs> yeah, definitely. So, I have been your co-host, Karmacore527, and we've been here with the main host, Moldy Worm Gaming. And this has been Piston Heads episode three. <laughs> have a good night. Yeah, thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you want to subscribe to the channel, that would be greatly appreciated. I'll leave a link in the description to Kyle's channel as well. But thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Where the link it, boy.